This video will look at the right foot articulated bones here from a superior view and then later in the video from a medial view. This is a plastic and I'll be going through the tarsal bones also called ankle bones. First starting with this largest of the tarsal bones, the calcaneus or heel bone. Then next will be to look at the talus. This articulates with the tibia and it's a weight-bearing joint thus prone to arthritic problems. The navicular bone right there and then this one here at the base, the, this medial cuneiform bone at the base there of the first toe and then the intermediate cuneiform And then the next one over here will be the lateral cuneiform bones, base of the those metatarsals. And then this cuboid bone will articulate with the fourth and fifth metatarsal. These are the metatarsal bones numbered one through five starting there with the medial and then going toward the lateral. These are the toes or phalanges. Each one of them is referred to as a phalanx. Now for the medial view. First to look at the arch. Here I've, driv I've drawn a line to indicate the longitudinal arch of the foot necessary for the strength of the joints the calcaneus or heel bone on a medial view the talus here again articulating with the tibia and this navicular bone that's between the talus and this medial cuneiform bone. The medial cuneiform articulates with the first phalanx or phalange right there, metatarsal number one. Again numbered number one here from the medial counting out through five to the lateral. And the big toe here with the proximal phalanx and then the next bone will be the distal phalanx missing in the big toe here is the medial phalanx whereas toes two through five will have all three including the medial phalanx bones.